All right, so look what made the trip home with me today. 1987, easy go, three wheel. It's electric, unfortunately. But that's going to change. It's all there, pretty much. See, we got the little tray in the back still. Seats have seen better days. Sewer number, it's an 87, 1987. Brakes still works somewhat. I have the uh, selector controls for it. Trying to get the seat out here. I might need two hands. Maybe not. As you can see, it's a nightmare. The battery tray rotted out. One of the batteries exploded. I think you can see that there. Uh, it's a mix between Trojan and Power Master batteries. DECA. What I'm planning on doing is pulling the electric motor out. See it down there. Pulling the electric motor out and making it a gas powered one. Now, I'm not sure what I want to do in that regard. I want to put an ATV engine in it. I want to put a Briggs V twin. I have a V twin, uh, an opposed twin, 16 horse Briggs that I can put in with centrifugal setup. Um, also got the aluminum grab bars. I don't know exactly what I want to do color wise for it. Bodies. My buddy got it at an auction house. The guy bought it from a I work with. And instead of picking it up from the side, they picked it up with the forklift from the front. And that's why these are bent. But it's gonna be driven off-road, so I'm not super worried about aesthetics of it. It's probably even gonna remain this sky blue, baby blue, whatever the hell you wanna call it, paint. Still got the fender. There's not much to it. The steering is really nice on it. It rolls really easily. And as a bonus, I have the 36 volt charger that was meant for it. To easy go texturing charger, which I may sell because I don't need it. I've got a little extra pillion backrests. And these are LT80 rims and tires. I have front and rears. These bolt right up to the bolt pattern. So, I'm probably gonna get, um, well just to get it running now, I'll probably throw tubes in those tires. And I might get polished rims for it to bling it out once I'm done. And uh, gnarly off-road tires. I want to have an extra seat for it too. So that's pretty much what I got going on. There's another shot of it. The suspension's actually soft compared to the four-wheel version. I think the three-wheel version is a little softer. It's all there. It's gonna make a nice little project. That's ugly.
has a sway bar in the back and everything. Needs a little sanding and painting. So, probably gonna power wash it, scrap the batteries, see where we end up. We could probably easily put a rear lift kit on this too. So easily. I want to raise it up a little bit. See, we got the little fender guards, bushwhackers, whatever you want to call them. So that's where we're at. So I guess if anybody has a suggestion what they want to see put in it, I'm probably going to go the 16 horse Briggs route since I have it, but I don't have a torque converter for it. I'm going to have to fab up something. The top they want to put the car engine in yours. I do like the uh, Honda setup he has in his though, with the auto clutch. Car engine Tom, car engine.